everyone, it is Tuesday, November 10th, and it is our third wedding anniversary. So we're celebrating tonight, we're still in the process of getting ready, but we're going to exchange gifts now, and then we're going to head to dinner um, down in Fort Lauderdale, so it should be fun. You ready for gifts? Let's do it. So Dave and I always hide our gifts from each other until we're ready to open, because we don't want to ruin the surprise. Ooh, that's so exciting. Got your gifts over here. Look how cute. To my wifey, my man. I forgot this stuff here. Huh? What was that? Nothing. Hiding stuff? You wanna go first? I guess so. First one. What do you think it might be? Shirt. <laughs> Why do you think that? Is this in a shirt box? What if I'm just being clever? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna waste any tape on this bad boy. <laughs> trying to get it to look right. So hard to get David in the whole frame because he's six foot eight. So sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There we go. We need to see your face. Hey, you tape this again? No. People who tape boxes are annoying. <laughs> Aww, a hoodie. Thought it'd be good Whoa, for Disney. Wow. That is so cool. I like this. It's good. I'm glad. That's awesome. Cool. Next. That's really cool. Next. I was wrong. Yes. I'm not sure. Nope. Well, close. <laughs> what is it? That's what I wanted. It's an alarm clock. Woohoo! That's cool. <laughs> it's one that you plug your phone into, and we don't have an alarm clock or anything in our room. David's been wanting something he can plug his phone into and everything, so gotcha that one. All right. My turn to speak. <laughs> I'm holding the camera. Hopefully, my reaction's more thrilling than yours. Mine was awesome. Yay, that's what I needed. You can try this out tonight. It's a um, thing for my camera so I can vlog and drive and not kill anybody. So I'm excited about that. Thanks, honey. You're welcome. This is oddly shaped. I don't know what it is. Oh, yay. I needed one of these bad, bad. It's another um, beauty blender. This is the Real Techniques one. Thank y'all. You're okay. welcome. I'm going to guess this is not a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Even though it's in a shirt box. I did take my box. Who does that? Why? Why? <laughs> so obnoxious. <laughs> Word to the wise, don't take boxes. They're going to stay just fine without tape. Ooh, a sleep mask. I need this because our dang sun goes right into our dang room. Feel Thank it. you. I did feel it. It was nice. That's exciting. Nightgowns. I asked for this one. I need some new pajamas. That one. And this one from Target, in case you're wondering. Because I picked them out. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, honey. Appreciate it. I'm excited. We got everything for the bedroom. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Happy anniversary. All right, guys. So I want to show you guys where I put my alarm clock. Of course, it's right beside my bed. But I want to show you guys why I wanted this and how cool it is. The reason I wanted it the most was because of this USB port that's right on the side. Because now I can be able to access my phone. Like in bed and stuff without it being a pain to get to a plug. Also, it's got this pretty cool little um, battery backup. So just unplugs right from there and you can plug it right in. And what's cool is it still charges from there too. So if I wanted to plug it into this, still charges. So I think that's awesome. So, thanks Maureen.
for our awesome anniversary present. So we just finished getting ready and we're about to head out and I thought I would show you guys my outfit since I don't normally dress up that much. Um, so I curled my hair, which is my regular curling iron, and then I have on this necklace that I got from this month's Rocks box, which I will probably share in the weekend vlog that's coming up. And then this dress I got from Ross. I have my gold Alex Anani bracelets on and then my wedges are from Target. So that's my outfit. Feeling pretty good. I um, am gonna bring a cardigan to her too because I think it's outside, so I might get a little chilly tonight, but that's my outfit. So I just put the camera in the new, what, what do you call that? Mount. Mount, mm -hmm. I guess, that David got me for, I was gonna say my birthday, for our anniversary. And we're not driving yet, we're stopped at a red light. And I noticed that the camera mount itself is shaking a lot when we drive. And I feel like it's even shaking now. So we'll have to see how it works out. Um, I don't know, I'm a little nervous about it, but we'll see. Here we go, green light means go. Let's check it out. You guys are the ultimate test. You'll have to let me know what you think about it and um, if you think it's gonna be good for vlog days. Obviously right now I'm in the passenger seat, so when I'm driving, the camera will be closer to me. So that might make a little bit of a difference, but we're driving. What do you think? Leave a comment below and let me know if I should exchange it or if I should keep it and um, if it works good, we'll see. We stopped over at the P.O. Box on our way out and I got this really cute kitchen towel from Amanda, Amanda W. here on YouTube. I'll link her channel below so you guys can check her out. I'm sure you probably already have because I talk about her a lot, but if not, I'll leave her link below go uh, subscribe to her channel anyway she sent me this really cute dashing through the snow kitchen towel and she said that um, it reminded her of me and my kind of rustic Christmas decor that I have in my house and I gotta also add that the card that she sent matches the towel perfectly and that's normal she knows me and my matchy matchiness so thank you Amanda that was so sweet I love it I can't wait to put it out I might start decorating more for Christmas tomorrow I'm trying to talk David into it We'll see how it goes. We have arrived. It's very dark. Can you see me? Hardly. Everything is very low, so David's having trouble. <laughs> and then the stage. It'll zoom. The stage is right there. They have a pretty extensive drink menu. We're excited. Our waitress just told us to come outside and check out the garden. Sorry it's so dark. There's a pretty waterfall and a bridge and then there's some stuff over here and then you can actually eat outside too if you want very pretty here's the Chinese oven they cook in so cool David ordered duck so I'm gonna guess it's gonna be cooked in that <laughs> it is <laughs> so our food has arrived I got lobster it looks too yummy David got duck we're excited we're so hungry
11. We just got home from our fancy dinner. Mine was pretty good. I got the lobster um, and it was like in some kind of sauce and the sauce was like super rich so it kind of made my stomach hurt a little bit so I didn't finish all of it. I finished most of it because for the amount I paid for it, I was going to eat that thing. <laughs> Dave and I don't do fancy dinners often so I was about to eat that whole thing. I also got a strawberry daiquiri and it was perfect. I would go to that place and just sit at the bar and have drinks because <laughs> David got a drink but his was not an alcoholic because he was driving. Are you? What are you doing? I'm... And I got um, an alcoholic one and on their menu it went from like mild, medium, and then like extra strong. Strong. So I got the mild um, strawberry daiquiri and it was perfect. Just enough alcohol, not too much. Yummy. Very good. David, you didn't love his. Oh, uh, what was wrong with mine? <laughs> well, I tried warnings too, and what? She doesn't stick my pillow myself. Yeah. yeah. I'm not. Alright, so I ordered duck, and I didn't expect it to be like duck on the bone, and it was on the bone, and I yeah. kind of upset me because we got our fancy restaurant, and you can't eat anything <laughs> on a bone. You can't peel it. It's so dumb. So I was kind of upset about that, but. I just wish I would have known that it would have come on the bones. I would have ordered something different, but it tasted fine, so it's yeah. not really a complaint. I was just showing, telling you my feelings. <laughs> the show was actually pretty cool. It was an hour-long awesome. show, and the fire part, which you guys saw, was probably the best. I don't know how they didn't set themselves on fire, yeah, or the really stage, cool. or the whole restaurant on fire. <laughs> It was insane, but it was really, really cool. I had a really good time. Um, it was nice to try something new. We've never been there before. It was about, it took us about two hours to get there just because we left at rush hour, but it was about an hour away. And yeah, it was really nice. I'm glad that we did it. I don't know that we would go back just because we did it. It was all right, but I mean, it was good. It was definitely something to do. I mean, if you live in South Florida, I would definitely check it out. It was called Mayakai Polynesian Restaurant. Yeah. I'll leave the link below. So if you guys are in the area and you want to check it out, I'll leave it there. And they also announced our anniversary on stage, and that was pretty nice. So that was our anniversary vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing how we celebrated our third wedding anniversary. Love you. Love you too. Give this video a thumbs up, and we'll see you in our next one. Bye, guys. Bye.